Okay, there are at least seven uh, banana plants in this pot here, in this container. For this winter, I'm just going to do exactly the same thing I did last year. We, my husband and I did not do anything. We left it here. And I know for a fact that uh, the root under the soil will stay alive and it'll come back the next year or the next spring. So we never bothered to really do anything as far as covering it to winterize. And you notice the leaves are starting to turn brown. It's feeling the change of the weather. And I'm just going to let that happen. As when the leaves dry up and fold over the main trunk, it acts as a windbreaker. And therefore, I guess it kept it warm so that uh, in springtime, what it did is it grew right here the new leaves start growing right on the very top right there the trunk did not die although the outer layer right here was covered with uh, brown uh, leaves in the outer part of the trunk but it kept it alive inside so when the leaves came back right on top right there It was already this tall and it will keep growing taller each year it gets stronger and we're actually going to uh, separate a lot of this new growth you see there and we're gonna situate them but for now this is where we're going to keep these plants especially now that the winter is approaching and this pot will actually keep it nice and warm the root and it should not feel the cold of the winter that that much so we are in zone 8 and we do have a much milder winter here than up north so being that we're in zone 8 uh, I really never have to do much to keep my banana plants uh, alive for the winter so that they could come back in springtime. So this banana here will die the leaves, the outer layer of it will uh, dry up, turn brown and it will insulate it. It acts as an insulation to the main uh, to the core of that banana plant and it will keep it warm and alive inside so that's how i keep it for the winter i don't do nothing else but just let it do its own thing and come springtime all i have to do is nourish it give it what it needs in order to revive itself so that's my update of my banana plant and we still got a lot of work to do here right inside that garden to get it ready for the winter.